How's it going everybody? Welcome to We Do Tech. Now it's time for another how to mine video where I show you guys how to mine certain cryptocurrencies. I help you set up a wallet, I help you set up the miner and just see that everything is going smoothly. I have made a few of these videos as well so if you are looking for a certain cryptocurrency to mine check out my channel I have made a few of these and perhaps I have made the one that you are looking for. Now also in these videos I do not go into the details about the cryptocurrency itself. For that, you have to go watch a different video online. There should be a few videos on all of the cryptocurrencies. This video is only gonna be about how to mine the cryptocurrencies. But now today's video is going to be how to mine electronium and especially we're going to show you guys on how to mine with your nvidia gpu i will also make a video on how to mine with your amd gpu and also with your cpu a bit later on but now with all of that being said let's get into the mining right after this do you live in South Africa and want to get into the crypto mining world? Well, RebelTech is the best place to get all of your mining hardware at extremely low prices. They have a massive range of graphics cards, motherboards and everything else you would need. So click on the link in the video description to go visit RebelTech and start building your new mining system. Okay, so first up, let's quickly check out the market cap for Electronium. So currently it does have a market cap of $373 million. Uh, it is trading for about seven cents now. It is going a bit down. It was pr doing pretty well in the 20th, 21st of uh, December around there. It is going a bit down now, but again, it, it probably will go up later on. You, you never know when you guys probably watch this video, it could be back up to uh, over a dollar perhaps. You never know. And then also it does have a circulation supply of just under 5 billion coins, a total supply of just over 5 billion coins and will have a max supply of 21 billion coins. So there should be plenty of them going around. Now also let's quickly check out the website where you can actually just click if you are on coinmarketcap.com you can just click here and you can also check out some of the markets that's actually selling them. But if you go to electronium.com you'll be greeted with just these coins falling and then you'll be able to download the wallets you want to need either on your, your Android device or on Apple that will be coming soon. Uh, but if we scroll down a bit, you'll just be able to see a bit more news on Electronium, some of the Yahoo answers, uh, Yahoo Finance, uh, Bloomberg, The Telegraph, a few companies that, that has already covered them. Yeah, so uh, Electronium was a crowd, sale, a crowd sale success, just a few stuff that you can go and read. Uh, also exchanges that are listed is Crypto, uh, Cryptopia, and then other uh, prospective listings, uh, Polynex, uh, bit phoenix bit tricks there's a few that you can just go and check out if you want to read up on the team you can also do that but now again if you just want to download the wallet for your phones you can just do it on android and apple will co be coming soon but otherwise you can just log in and create an account and then i already have an account so i'm just quickly going to go to there but just follow the on-screen instructions it's pretty straightforward once you're in your wallet, you'll be able to see how much uh, electronium you have. Uh, you'll be able to send it. You'll be able to import from an offline wallet and you'll be able to have your address here. So you will need this address to uh, receive and then also send Ethereum. So I'm really just going to copy it. Then I do have it for a bit later on. You'll be also able to go to some exchanges. Uh, again, all of this changes over here. Uh, your pin settings, there's just a bunch of stuff you can do. Okay, but now if you do go back to the Electronium webpage, you can click on the downloads tab up here, and then you'll be able to see uh, the different pools that you, you can use and CPU if you want to set other uh, miners up yourself, you can do that. But we're gonna just click on here for the alternative mining pools then we'll be able to see all of the different ones that you can use. Now, most of these are quite small. Some of them only have like four to 10 miners currently mining. The one that I actually found that was the biggest, which is apparently not here, is actually nanopool.org. Now they do have a, miner, the, a pool for Electronium. So I will leave a link for this also in the description, but you can just go to etn.nanopool.org 
uh, you'll be able to see that it, they do have about 6,700 miners, 20,000 workers, and a pool hash rate of 7,530 kilo hashes a second. So once you're here, you can just go to the help page and then you'll be able to scroll down and you'll see again because we use Nvidia, we're going to use Nvidia for this one you'll be able to go to the TSIV where you can download the CC miner uh, I already do have it over here I will actually link this entire file in the description as well for you to download so you don't have to set up all of this it's just going to be a lot easier but if you do already know how to set up some of these stuff then you can do it all you have to do is uh, if you, you have a local wallet you're going to use this command if you have exchange wallet you're going to use this command now because we're going to use the one with the address we got from uh from the from the electronic web page we are going to use the local wallet so you can copy that and do it yourself if you want to all you have to do is let you your wallet address your worker name email address and then you're gonna have to just check some of the stuff you you will also need to change but anyway i'll again i will leave mine in the video description so it's just a lot easier than you don't have to do anything but if you get your and you just want to do it yourself you can go uh, you have to create your bat file because currently inside there is not a bat file so what you'll have to do is create your own bat file now and how you do that is just right click new text document and just type in whatever run or start and then dot bat so just save that I'm gonna replace that I already do have one and then if you can't create your bat file it's probably because you have to change something so just go to view options view and you'll be able to see that the hide extensions for known file types make sure that is unticked so otherwise you're not going to be able it's still just going to be a text file so just untick that and you'll be able to edit your bat file now now if you go right click on your bat file and say edit you'll see either if you use mine or you just want to create your own you'll be if you create your own then there's not going to be anything on, anything inside you're going to have to use this one to add in all your, all your details but otherwise you can just use mine it's just going to be a bit easier so first up it's uh, in the command it's going to be cc miners dash x 64.exe so this tells the dot bat file to use the cc miner program over here the a is for your algorithm so we're using the crypto night algorithm the o is for your server that we're going to use so it's a stratium uh, nano pool server so over there the u is for your address that you got uh, at the beginning of the video when you created your account so you're going to use that address and paste it in here now make sure you do paste in yours otherwise you're going to mine for me uh, i would appreciate that but you're not going to get anything so I'd rather just uh, take out mine and just add yours the next up you're going to have to put in a full stop and then it's going to be your miner's name so i'm just calling my miner2 again a full stop and this is going to be your email address now you're going to use this for nanopool to be able to change your payouts and then also they'll be able to let you know when the miner has stopped so you can set up a notification for that as well so once that is done you can just exit it's going to ask you to save if you changed anything and then all you have to do is double click and run okay, and then once you've actually ran the program for a while you can go back to the ethereum uh, nano pool and then just type in your address over here and then just say search so it's going to pick up your address it's not going to be immediately you are going to have to leave it to mine for quite a while about an, an a half an hour to an hour before it actually picks up something so at the moment this is just before i made this video i tested it so just give it a bit uh, but you will see that it does, it will pick up after a while so i mine for a few hours and this is what i got so balance is almost five uh, etn so all you have to do is just leave it for a while to mine you'll be able to see your hash rate this won't be exactly what you get on the miner 
but don't worry it will catch up a bit later especially with this for the last hour it doesn't pick up anything last 24 hours it's only 81.6 hashes a second so that's because it divides it by 24 so don't pay attention too much to these you can just make sure that your miner is running and that it is picking up over here now you'll be able to see your different miners you use down here so at the moment i only have my miner 2 you can see your payouts i currently have no payouts because my minimum payout is set to 500 so if you want to change that all you have to do is go to settings up here and then add in your email that you used in the bat file that I showed you guys. And then add your minimum payout. Now that is going to be a minimum payout of 100 or a max payout of 100,000. So you can just add that if you wanted to change it. Currently mine again is set to 500. So once you've added your email, once you've set it to 100, you can just click apply. And it is going to set it to a minimum payout of the, the amount you selected. And then once it reaches that amount, you'll be paid out, again, probably with 100 ETN. And then that's going to go into your wallet, which you can then spend, sell, whatever you want to. So yeah, that's pretty much it to set up your miner. Just to quickly recap, uh, I will, again, leave my entire miner uh, in the video description for you to download so you don't have to do anything. Otherwise, you can do it yourself with CC Miner. It's not too hard. Uh, right click, edit, just change your Ethereum, uh, your Electronium address. Make sure that it's not mine. And also add your miner name, add your email address, and then you are set to mine. And then also, again, just leave it for a bit to mine before you check. I've had so many of you that actually complain that you don't uh, you don't get anything, but you message me straight after that you actually started. Give it some time. Don't be that hasty. Just give it some time and about an hour, and you'll be able to see that it is going to pick up. And then you'll be able to see that you are actually picking up your hashes uh, that you are working. Uh, now you can also have a calculator going here if you uh, are mining for uh, a while. We'll be able to see how much per minute, per hour, per day, per month, and then just calculate after that. So again, it's not uh, Electronium is not that valuable at the moment. So this is more going to be to uh, pick it up and, and store it for later on when it's uh, worth a lot more. So this is only for that. Otherwise, you can just go buy it on the exchanges itself. But yeah, that's pretty much it. My miner is running over here. Uh, so we can just leave it to run for a while still. Uh, like I said again in the beginning, I am also going to make a miner on a video on how to mine it with AMD cards and then also with your CPU. Uh, so it's pretty straightforward. I'll just show you guys how to do that. But anyway, that's, yeah, that's pretty much it on how to set up your miner to mine Electronium. So that's pretty much it for this video on how to mine. I do hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please like, share, subscribe, and comment like always. Also, if you have any suggestion for a different cryptocurrency uh, you want me to show you how to mine, just drop me a comment down in the comment section. So yeah, just drop it down there. Uh, also, if you are struggling with anything, let me know in comments down below. Uh, me or anybody else uh, who's watching this video might be able to help you. So just let me know down there. But I also, like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, I have made a few of these how to mine videos. So you can go check out some of my other videos if you want to learn how to mine certain cryptocurrencies because there are a bunch. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will check all of you next time. Cheers, guys.